we're off to Penguin Island. Standing about 12 inches high, these African penguins are one of 17 penguin species. A species is a group of animals that are similar to each other. Of the 17 species of penguins in the world, only seven live where it's cold. And the African penguins are not one of them. So here we are at the aquarium uh, with my friend Jen. And Jen, what do we have here? These are two of our juvenile uh, African or black-footed penguins. Will they turn black and white at some point? Absolutely. This is uh, their second set of feathers. Um, and this is what we call their juvenile plumage. So when they first hatch out of their egg, they have very soft down feathers right. that are not waterproof. Um, right around, say, about three months of age, which is what these guys are, um, they're gonna lose, they're gonna molt. All those little soft downy feathers are gonna fall off, and this sort of silver coloration is gonna come in. These feathers are waterproof, and this is when mom and dad would start encouraging them to come down to the ocean, uh, learning how to swim, and starting to find food on their own. So they all keep this particular plumage till they're somewhere between a year, year and a half, and then they'll grow in new feathers that are the more typical black and white that you think of for penguins. Right. And at that time, they'd be considered an adult penguin. So penguins are birds, correct? Yes, penguins are a bird, although they are a little bit different because they cannot fly. Uh, penguins are uh, very good swimmers, so they sort of fly through the, through the water. Right, and their wings here seem to look almost like flippers. They do use their wings to power them through the water, and then they, they lay their feet out behind them, so they'll use their feet and their tail to kind of help them steer. They do have an oil gland at the base of their tail, and it helps them to be waterproof. It's kind of hidden right back here. And they'll collect the oil from that area and they'll spread it all around on their feathers. This helps with the water to bead right off. What do these African penguins eat? Uh, they are predominantly fish eaters, but they do eat some different types of invertebrates. In Africa, one of their main food sources would be sardines. We tried to offer our colony sardines and they didn't really appreciate them so much. So we feed the majority of their food is capelin, and then we also offer herring and squid. This is so cool. Thank you, Jen, for sharing. You're very welcome. Nice to have you. With us and letting us know about these African penguins. Thanks.